Hey, what's up guys? It's Cliff with Paint Flamingo Power Wash. I'm back with a brand new video for you guys. Today we're gonna be doing some new concrete cleaning in Odessa, Florida for this customer. Uh, he, they reached out to me a day or so ago and um, wanted to get this cleaned up. They got a pressure washer uh, and I think they tried to do it already, but it was not working. Obviously you can just do <laughs> use water to take that stuff off. So uh, today we're gonna get them all squared away. It's new concrete, so we're not gonna pressure wash it. We're pretty much gonna do a, a, a soft wash on the concrete. Uh, it's, pretty, it's a pretty large driveway, but it's only one area we're gonna be focusing on uh, for this project here. So let's go check it out. Before I go, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Next week, we will be doing the giveaway. Like I said, I was gonna let this thing, uh, the link run through the end of the month. It's the end of the month, so we're gonna cut it off. Hope everybody got uh, had a time to uh, get in. You know, and good luck to everybody that has already, uh, you know, entered to the giveaway. So let's go check the job out. All right, so this is what we're working with over here. It was just cloudy over the top of me. Now the sun is coming out. But you guys can see this big algae spot, the green spot right here. We're gonna apply some SH to it. Almost a light rust over here. I think this car doesn't move too much. It was sitting here when I got here, so I'm thinking that's what that is. I'm not here for rust removal, only only just the the green algae from the trees. So uh, we're gonna apply, I'm gonna go hot, probably put like a 7% down with the soft wash system. 7% of SH, sodium hypochlorite or chlorine, whatever you wanna call it. And uh, we're just gonna rinse it off. So I got my gun already out. We're gonna start applying now. Put me a nice layer down. I'm only doing um, up to the garage, uh, the joint right there next to the garage. I'm not doing the whole entire driveway. So I don't surface clean driveways if it's under, under two years old. I guess you could do it, you know, if you want to take the chance, you can put some bigger tips on your surface cleaner. And then uh, that'll lower your pressure super, super low. I personally don't take that risk, but I've seen other people do it. It's all up to you. Some people out there, that's all they do is soft wash concrete. They come in, put a super hot mix down and just rinse it. <laughs> Especially if it's not too bad. I like the surface cleaning because I make sure I get, you know, all the way down, down in there. green line from the roof line right there. I'm gonna treat that up. Go spray that spot right here for you guys.
of course if you were doing this with a driveway that has uh you know grass like nice grass around it you want to make sure you water down the grass fully before you start obviously i'm not working around any grass area right here so i'm able to spray it without having to you know spray the grass down And uh, the nozzle I'm using on this um, J-Rod right now is a 6530 tip. So it's a nice wide fan, super wide fan. I do have a couple more tips on the, on the J-Rod. Uh, I got a 0040 tip on here when I want to shoot really far. And then I have a 2540 tip as well. Which is Come, come, come out. That's what I'm spraying. I ain't gonna tell them. I knew it. Uh, just a commercial cleaner. Sir, when I'm done, you gotta leave me a five star review. <laughs> I'm glad you didn't scar the concrete up. You said you have a pressure washer, right? It's just a little tiny one, like this big. Oh, okay, okay. So they have enough pressure to do. Yeah, yeah it's, it's good to clean the side of the house. Right. But yeah, and on the way, on the way here, I was like, oh man, I hope he didn't go try to like use pressure to get that stuff off. What does it do? If you, if you do? It takes the cream off the top, that like the the white layer. It takes it off and then um, it, it, it'll leave a mark behind. That it's, it, once that, once you get those marks, it's like so hard to blend it in. So yeah, that's why I don't clean concrete like with the pressure washer unless it's like over two years old. Cause by then it's hard enough. So right now it's still kind of soft. All right, you guys, so I just got done spraying. The concrete, you can see that big spot is already gone. I'm just gonna let that sit for a little bit, let it eat up everything. And then we just gonna give it a rinse with a ball valve. I'm not gonna use the gun. Like I said, you don't want no pressure. If you are gonna use the gun, you wanna use either your uh, your rinse tip for your uh, your soap tip for your, uh, on your J-Rod, or you can use your rinse tip from your J-Rod because it's gonna be like low pressure, you know? You don't want no high pressure or at all. So we're gonna let that sit and we're gonna come back and give it a good rinse with the ball valve.
Alright guys, so I'm gonna finish rinsing this up here and then what I'll do is I'll put a post treatment on here with the same exact mix. So if I miss anything, and also it'll make the concrete brighter. As you guys can see, everything is already cleaned up over here nicely. The spots are gone. Customer watch me the whole time. Give him a show. Sometimes you gotta give him a show, man. <laughs> Alright, stay tuned. Okay, you guys, we all finished with the project. Everything came out great. Let's go check it out. All right, so this is the top here. It's starting to dry. Like I said, I put a post treatment on here just to, you know, make it pop some more. But you can see all that green that was here is gone. Of course, the sun comes out and I got shade over the top of me. Should be able to still see where the big stain was earlier which was right over here in this part and then this part right here nice and clean easy hot mix and rinse off and like i say if you're gonna do it around like a nice grassy area make sure you water down the grass before you do it so you don't uh, burn the grass but yeah she, she's looking pretty good sucks that I got this sun over the top of me all these shadows but hopefully you guys can tell all right guys well that's how you keep you clean new concrete hope y'all learned something new today if you got any questions just ask them in the comment sections I got you y'all stay tuned I'm gonna see y'all in the next one peace